Craig Cohen 87 here for episode 77 of the Iron Den. You know, I like the sound of that. 77. Okay, so it's Monday. I'm going to hit the gym. I'm going to do some chest and shoulders today, my favorite day of the week. I'm probably going to be mixing stuff up. Mixing stuff up. That's a weird sight. Anyways, I'm going to be mixing uh, my, my workout schedule up once I get back to knowing exactly what I want to do. I think my coach is all right with me working out, but he's in France, so we haven't messaged each other too much. He needs a week off. We've been working really, really tirelessly with at least, at least 100 athletes. So that's fine. But uh, I'm, I'm back to 100%, so I'm going to go hit the gym. I'm going to go hit some other body parts. I want to start keep hitting legs twice a week. We'll see how that goes. Um... The legs are still sore, so I couldn't do legs today. For me, legs take a good three days to recover, you know? And I don't want them to recover any faster. Like, I want to completely annihilate my legs in the gym to the point where it's hard to walk for days, which I've done. But, uh, you know, I'm feeling the the chest. The chest is feeling a bit flabby, so I want to go hit some, uh, some chest. It's Canada Day in Canada. We celebrate it on July 1st. The Americans celebrated on July 4th. They call it Independence Day. So it's basically a holiday today. My gym's open every day of the year. It never closes, which I love. 613 lift, shout out. But uh, I'm guessing there'll still be a decent amount of people there, but it won't be packed. But we're a, it's, you know, it's a hardcore gym. We don't take days off. So because I don't have to go to work and I have the whole day, I really wanted to get in the gym and train hard and do my favorite workout. And I'm still, I might test out the lat a bit in the gym, but I won't be loading it up super heavy. And then we'll see, maybe tomorrow I work out back. We'll see if my coach gets back to me or not. Or maybe I take tomorrow off, train legs on Wednesday, and then train, train Thursday, Friday, Saturday. I'm probably going to go back to five days a week. We'll see how it goes. My endurance has gotten a lot better than, it, than it's been. Because I, I really, I go 100% in the gym and I, I burn out a lot. And I, I, I like to get a lot of rest. But because I am enhanced and I'm taking, I'm on the juice, I, I don't need as much rest. I could train harder for longer. That's one of the benefits of being on gear or taking steroids. So I really got to push that as far as I can because, uh, well, I got to get serious. So, so yeah, I actually just decided I was going to go do the gym about an hour ago. I was going to take today off and wait for my coach, but, uh, just based on the one message I did get from him, I got the sense that it would be okay to resume my training as long as I'm feeling up to it and I do feel up to it. All right, I didn't have an energy drink this morning, so I'm a little low energy right now, which is good. That means I'm, I have all my energy in me. It's, I'm just not expressing it. So once I have my pre-workout in me, I should be good to go. And the first exercise will be pec deck. All right, that's all for now. See you in the gym. All right, first working set of chest since June 13th. And on June 13th, I got 145 for 13 reps. We'll see what I get this week. I think it'll be more, but who knows if my power went down or not. I'm fully rested, so that should work in my favor. I'm gonna go, same as always, nice and slow. Deep, 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 deep stretch, hold it, and then fully extend. Gonna hit the smelly salts, and then begin. Ooh. All right, let's do this shit. Let's get my back. Bring one of these at a time. Oh, shit. I got to set it to the correct weight. That was still warm-up weight. Oh, and one more thing. My back knee is so badly, it's bothering me. So I'll have to overcome that as well. But success is rarely convenient. Remember that, folks? Remember that, kids. All right. Nice and slow, all the way back. Deep stretch in the chest. 
<sighs> One. Two. Three. Four. Five. <laughs> Fourteen. Keep going. Fifteen. Ah, set. Woo! Ninety seconds begins now. All right. Time for second set. Back to warm up weight, 115 pounds. Now, this machine is very heavy, believe it or not. It's the heaviest one I've ever used. On any other machine, I can max it out. But this one, half the stack is, is, is oh, more, is heavier than that. And it only goes to 295. So my guess is it's all the levers and, and access points that makes it hard. Anyways, time's up. Let's see what I got for with 115. Oof. Just like before. Deep stretch, deep stretch. Open that, open that chest up. Keep opening it as far as it'll go. Oof. One. Oof. Three. I want to get those elbows back. Four. Oh. Five. I'm already on fire. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Two more. Oh, Eleven. Oh, two more. No, ah, uh, fuck. Uh, 90 seconds begins now. Third and final. Down to my lowest warm up weight, which is 85 pounds. It's kind of low, but my, my chest is like on fire right now. And my back is kind of sore from all my back knee. I know. Oh, didn't lower it again. I don't know why I keep forgetting that. I'm a little slow. You have to excuse my friend. He's a little slow. All right. <sighs> One. Two. Three, four, feels really light so far. Five, oh, there's the sweet spot, right there. Open up the hands, open the hands, there it is. Six. Seven. Ah, I'm on fire. Eight. Nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, uh, 14, <laughs> excellent, excellent. 
All right, let's go ahead and press in movements. All right. It's time for my first pressing movement. I'm looking forward to it. The warm up went very well. I was slinging those 80 pounds around like they were nothing. Let's go hit 95. Last time I got 12 reps. So I'm pretty sure I'll do more, but that remains to be seen. Again, I'm not going to try to get more. I'm going to try to go to failure with the best quality I can do. I'm not chasing numbers. My ego is right there at the door. If I only do four, I only do four, but I'll do more than four. All right, let me get some smelly salts and nail this fucking set. Woo! Never get used to that, but that's the point. All right, 95 pounds. Let's do this shit. Oh, yeah. Get that back nice and arched. Up and together. One. Slow all the way down. Two. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Slow negative. Slow. Oh. All right, only nine, but that was an excellent nine. Let's count to 120. All right, final set. Dumbbell chest press incline, 75 pounds. Really, I'm happy with 10 or better. Let's see what I got. Just like before, quality over quantity. Do this shit. Get those tits out. One. Two. Three. on fire all right only got seven but that was like the best seven I've ever done all right let's go hit some flat dumbbells all right time to hit some flat dumbbells last time I got 95 for 10 uh, I'm gonna drop it down to 85 pounds I want to guarantee that I hit double digits let's go hit some mel smelly salts Very good. Yeah, I want to guarantee that I have it. And I don't mind working my way up to a higher weight over time. All right, let's do this shit. All the way down. Arc that back. One lockout. Control the negative. Two. Three. Four. 
Nine. Uh. Wow, three sets in. I still haven't hit a double digit set. But that's okay. The quality is high, and I got two nines, so that's pretty close. All right, 90 seconds begins now. All right. The last of the pressing dumbbell movements. This will be 65 pound dumbbells. Let's see if I can hit 10, but you know, if I get nine, I get nine. 65 pounds, so it's fairly low. It's gonna feel light, but my chest is throbbing right now, which is good. It's gonna be sore tomorrow. Let's go pour some fire on, pour some gasoline on that fire. All right. Don't forget to arc the back. One, I want to work out my chest, not my shoulders. Two. Three. Four. Six. Seven. Eight. One more. Nine again. I'll take it. All right, let's go finish myself off on dips. All right, let's hit some weighted dips. 25 pounds. Last time I got it for nine reps. I'm feeling good. Even though I didn't hit the high numbers that I normally do, I think I went deeper and slower than I normally do, which is saying a lot for me, if you've seen me train before. All right, just like before, nice and slow and deep. I want to tear these titties apart. All right, let's do this shit. Go all the way down. One. Two. it is. Ooh. Failure achieved. Let's count 90 seconds and start again with body weight. All right, final set of dips will be with body weight, just like before, low and slow. All right. Let's torture the body. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. 
All right, I matched last week's numbers, or three weeks ago numbers. <sighs> Definitely weaker, no question about it. All right, let's do my top set. Reverse tech deck, 130 pounds. Not lighting the world on fire or anything here. I just want to nail that rear pack, uh, nail that rear delt to get a, a full 3D look. All right, let's do this. Nice big circles. Shoulders low. Let's do this. One, nice and slow. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Keep going. Eight. Nine. Ten. Ooh. 60 seconds begins now. Let's go hit the second set. 100 pounds. Just like before. I want to feel all the tension in my rear shoulders. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Ah. Check. Definitely weaker, but I still got eight.
All right, let's chat about my first chest exercise since June 13th. Well, I enjoyed it very much. It was very good. Uh, power is down a little bit, no question about it. But, uh, you know, my technique is excellent. My chest is nice and ugh, sore. That's exactly what I want. It Actually, I don't feel any pain. It's kind of numb. I'll feel it tomorrow. But, uh, yeah, there's no big takeaways. But although my power is going down, it's going down very slowly. Very, very, very slowly. So, you know, I'm not worried about it. What matters most is what I look like, and I think my physique is, is still improving week after week. Um, the only thing I'd really say is now, because I haven't been doing my posing five days or six days a week, I'm getting a little rustier. I think it's getting a little worse. But I'll be back in the gym pretty much... Fuck, I want to go back in the gym five days a week now. But i got to figure out what I want to do tomorrow. Am I going to do a leg? If my legs are feeling good tomorrow, I'll do legs. If they're not feeling well, I'll do back. Yeah, that's how I'll do it. Yeah, I think that's how I'm going to do it. So stand by. Having said that, going back to this workout, uh, technique is excellent, you know? Zero pain, zero pain, because I remember I was feeling a little something in the pack, a little something in the shoulder, and just just taking some time off from the gym made a big difference. Made a big difference right away. I I felt I felt very good. The acne is really bothering me though. Every time I would press my my back against a, a bench on any 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 all the exercises, it hurts. Like even just against this car, I feel it. My zits are are massive. But you know what? That that's fine. It's going it's going away. They're drying out actually. So even though they look worse, they look worse cuz they're actually getting dried out. So that's like worse than that on my back. But anyways, they are drying out. Hopefully it'll be gone in in a few months. But I'm seeing a lot of progress. I got another dermatologist appointment uh a week from Saturday. Yeah. So I'm making progress. That's all I could ask for. My goal isn't to have everything I want right now. It's to work towards it in the future. I'm very positive. I'm feeling good. I'm going to come back and work out hard. My lats, my lats is, I I consider it 100%. I can't even tell which lat was injured. I know it was the left one because I've been talking about it so often. But just based on feeling, I can't even feel a little bit. Not even 1%. So I'll be able to train, to train back tomorrow or legs. I definitely want to hit legs twice a week, but the thing is with legs is I need three days. I need three days to rest after I do legs. So I'm thinking if I hit legs on, see if I were to train Tuesday. I don't know that I'd want to do legs Wednesday. No, I could do legs Wednesday. Then I would take the Thursday off. Do shoulders Friday. And then do legs Saturday, which gives me my Thursday and Saturday that I like to do. And then I would take Sunday off and then come back to the gym on Monday. Yeah, I mean, that works for me. I'm okay with that. All right, so now you know the game plan. So I'll leave us off here. Thank you very much for watching. And until next time, peace out.